Hello again, everybody. This is Leo Falcom, Technology Concierge with Courtesy Acura, and we're doing another quick how-to video today. Today, we're in a 2017 Acura MDX. I wanted to show you the new XM playback feature that has been developed and incorporated into our car. So what I mean by XM playback is, of course, with the purchase of a brand new Acura, you get 90 days free of XM radio. Now, we have the technology that from the time that you start the vehicle, the vehicle will actually record any preset radio stations that you have for the XM channels so if you are on a long road trip and you're an hour down the road and you decide no longer that you want to listen to your favorite country station but you want to switch to your favorite jazz station you have the ability to switch to that jazz station and actually rewind it all the way to the point where you started the car we're gonna take a quick second and I'm gonna show you just what I mean about that and today we have had the vehicle running for I don't know, maybe 15 or 20 minutes now, so we're not gonna be able to play back an hour. However, I wanna show you how it works today. Here we're gonna pan to our XM preset menu screen. On this screen, we see right now that we have presets one through six, and if we needed to, we would go to 12. We're not gonna worry about it today. The bottom of these, this particular screen happens to show what station we're listening to, which is the coffee house, um, and I'm gonna show you how to play it back if you'd like to listen to this song one more time. Here, we're gonna go to the playback feature where it opens up a new menu. We have our live feature that shows us exactly where we are in terms of listening to the music on XM. And on the left-hand side, we have our, our options to go backwards or pause and play the live music. So if I wanted to go one song back, I would use the track backwards button to go to the beginning of the song Catch and Release by Matt Simmons. If I wanted to go even farther than one minute and 57 seconds back, I can continue to use the button and go as far back as I would like until I find either when I started the vehicle or a song that I would have preferred to watch. If I wanna go forward again or skip a song that I don't wanna to listen to after I've gone backwards, I go to the right hand side of the screen and use the skip forward option to come forward to find a song that I would rather listen to. Now, if I wanted to go back to live music, there's a very easy live feature right here that I can just click on and we're listening to what's happening right now on that station. Now, here's the coolest part of this. If I exit out of my playback options and I switch to a new preset that I've already established in the car, I can go back to the playback menu and still have the ability to rewind this station to find a song that may have already played that I wanted to listen to. Let's see if we can find something 60s that, uh, oh yeah, something right there. Exactly, turn it up a little bit, and this happened six minutes ago for us. Oh, and this is a great song. We're just hanging out right now. Let's say it's one I didn't like so much. Perfect, we're gonna jump ahead to the next song, or you know what, let's just go back to live because that's how we wanna listen to it right now. Very easy and simple to use. Uh, just remember that it only records as long as you have the car on, running, and playing XM radio. As soon as you turn off the car, it loses that data. It never, never saves anything. Again, this is Leo Falcom here with Courtesy Acura and whoever this happens to be behind me right now. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give us a call. Our phone number is 303-795-7800. Also visit us on our website, that's courtesyacuralittleton.com. Um, thanks again for tuning in today, and again, Acura, stay classy.